Hi everyone, welcome to Science Tutorial for You, and in this video I'm giving a test on alkene molecules. Before I carry on, please give a pause, try these questions, and then I'll give you the answers. So if you want to pause now, please do so. Okay, let's do this. Question number 1a. Why alkene molecules can dechlorize bromine water? And the answer is because alkene molecules contain double bond. One out of one. Okay. Question number 1b. How many covalent bond can carbon occupy? The maximum number of bond that carbon can occupy is four. Four bond. One out of one. Question number 2a. What is the general formula of alkene? Now, the general formula of alkene is Cn H2n. Okay, we leave it like that. Uh, if we put plus 2, that's for alkane. But for alkene, we just leave it as 2n. Alright, 1 out of 1. Question 2b. Complete this for alkene. So, using the general formula, we could complete this. So, we can see that there's 3 carbon over here. If it's 3 carbon, the hydrogen just double for alkene. So, if it's 3, this one is 6. Because n and this one is 2n, so we just always we always double it. Now hydrogen is 10 over here, so obviously carbon has to be the half of it, so this is 5. It's 2 marks, 2 out of 2. Question number 3. Name this alkene molecules. Um there is 4 carbon over here, 1, 2, 3, 4, n is an alkene, so it is butene. There's two carbon over here, so this is ethene. All right, the last question. Okay, question four now. Complete the hydrogen atom for propene. I want you to put the number of hydrogen atoms where it should belongs to. So we can see that this carbon has two bonds already and can only have a maximum of four bond. So I could have two more. This carbon has one, two, three bonds already, so you can have one more. This carbon has one, so you can have three more. And if you count all of them, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay, so three carbon, they should have six hydrogen. Okay, one out of one. Everything add up to eight marks. You got eight out of eight, well done. So if you did bad in the test, you can go and check my video on alkene. Thank you and I'll see you in my next video where I'll be comparing alkane and alkene.